Hey everyone, welcome to the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you'd like to hang out in between videos. Come check out the Discord. We're also doing exclusive content over on Patreon. We're in the middle of the second world. We're doing Mamamoo TV Season 4 right now, as well as Strong Woman Dobong Soon and Studio Moon Knight with, uh, with Wien this week. Today, though, we have another bit of Moonbill and Wien content, this time a new OST that just dropped. Um, so at this point, we don't have like a music video. We only have an intro video and the lyric video. So that's what we're going to do. Let's get into it. All right. So we're going to start off with this intro video. It's very short, only 42 seconds. However, we don't have like real captions. We only have auto translated captions. So I'm really hoping that they do the job. But if not, we'll just kind of enjoy the vibes, I guess. Let's go. 안녕하세요. 마마무 휘인입니다. 네, 이번에 저희가 JTBC 드라마 비밀은 없어 OST에 참여하게 되었어요. Okay, it's for no secrets. 비밀은 없어라는 곡을 들어보시면 뭔가 익숙하시지 않나요? 이 곡은 시원한 여름에 어울리는 바다 소리와 말랑한 신스티드, 신나는 힙합 드럼을 사용하는 곡으로 룰라의 비밀은 없어를 저희만의 스타일로 편대서 okay. 신나게 제작한 곡입니다. 네, 저희가 참여한 OST 비밀은 없어 많은 사랑 부탁드리고요. 유치하고 바칙한 인생 I guess the auto translate gave up part way through. 또 많은 관심 부탁드립니다. 감사합니다. 안녕. Okay. All right. So that gave us a little bit of an insight into what the song is going to be like with a soft uh, synth sound and like some drum pads and that it was telling the story of this character Lula in their in Mamamoo's style. Um, I'm really excited to see what Wien and Moonbeal like as a essentially a subunit ends up working like. Um, their harmonies in regular Mamamoo tracks are some of my favorite parts of their discography. So yeah, let's check it out. It is got a really soft vibe to it. It's got like a dance break.
Oh, that's it? Oh, man, that felt short. Uh, it really wasn't all that short, but it felt it. It just kind of blew by. Um, the thing for me that I think really stuck out was a lot of that kind of ping pong style singing where they sped up the beat and it would go back and forth between Win and uh, Moonbill, with Moonbill kind of taking the lead in parts and then Win uh, doing the response. Like almost, yeah, it was almost call and response um, sounding. And like, I think that was really neat. And then obviously, anytime you get harmony between those two, it's golden. Um, and I felt like a couple of the, the sections there had some pretty nice um, harmonies, as well as just kind of like it was very easy to listen to. Um, the soft kind of instrumental mixed with Wien's really beautiful head voice and like Moonbill going for a very um, fast but soft tone. Um, just let it be very like pleasant. It was just like a, it was something that you could listen to. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It's other than easy listening. It's just very nice. Um, as far as the, as the lyrics go, like it's expressing this feeling of like, I've told you everything already. I, there's no more need for secrets with you. I can just be open and honest about it, um, about how much I like you, about how much um, you mean to me. And it's become obvious, right? Even if I didn't say anything, you would know. Um, and in that sense, it's very, very cute. I I like this a lot. I did. I do kind of wish we got like a music video with it, right? Like some something to show off how it fits into the drama or something to show how they recorded it together or something like that. But maybe we'll get that in the future. It is just like the first day that it's out. Hey guys, emergency quick add to this video. Uh, I saw that as I was waking up this morning, they added a music video for Frankly Speaking. Um, so we're gonna watch it. Let's go. Still a vibe. Oh. She keeps hitting him in the chest. Is this just kind of like a straightforward romantic uh, K drama? Hey, feeling his heartbeat. Hmm. No. Oh. Oh. Is it like a mud wrestling game? This seems sweet. Look at 
He seems very competitive. Yeah, so that didn't really give me much in terms of like what the show was about, but it did kind of give me a vibe for uh, their cute interactions and like the romantic vibe that those two have, um, which is a lot of what that song was about, right? Like how they were so unable to keep secrets from one another because they were so into um, the other person. Um, yeah, I thought that was cute. It was a good vibe, and the song, you know, obviously slaps. I've listened to it a few times since recording the initial uh, part of this video, and yeah, it still kicks ass. But anyways, back to past me to wrap up. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed this. Um... Until next time, guys. Love you. Bye.